Hello there, you guys. How's everyone doing today? Welcome back to, I guess, the ocean of Rosewood. Today is a little bit different. Uh, as you can see, I am joined by actually two mods and one viewer, which is pretty darn awesome. Uh, and uh, <laughs> we're uh, we're going to be heading out to the island. We're going to be uh, doing a little bit of some tours. I thought I'd show off some of that in the Let's Play, so I hope you guys are looking for it forward to it, rather, sorry. It is very late, I just finished streaming. I'm a bit tired, you guys probably already know that if you've watched the stream. Anyways, as you can see, I'm in the front. Sitting beside me is Forrest. Sitting behind me is uh, Mayor Vanilla, and Captain is flirting with, with Gavin, apparently, or rather known as Arcadis. His character's name is Gavin. I always not sure which one to say. I think I'm gonna try and stick with Arc or Arcadis for this episode. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I thought this should be fun. Um, there is one main reason why I want to have this many people, so the maximum amount of people, in my town at once uh, while I do the tours, and you guys will see exactly why that is, other than it being, like, you know, three times as much fun. Okay, so here we are. Here's all of us. Um, I think I'm gonna leave Argutus to choose the, uh, the tour if he so chooses. And obviously everyone's changing, everyone's getting ready. <laughs> this is rather exciting. I really enjoy coming out to the island with, uh, with friends and viewers. I've done it a couple times on stream, usually with mods, occasionally with other viewers, and, uh, it's always been quite a good time. But uh, other than when I was coming out to purchase, uh, not purchase, rather find a lot of flowers, I think it was, what, two episodes ago now? Uh, I haven't really shown you guys the tours too extensively, so I thought this should be fun. Alright, so we're going on a beetle hunting tour. Awesome. Hey there, whippersnappers! Thanks for joining us on the beetle hunting tour. You ready to catch some beetles? We'll be catching dynastid beetles, stag beetles, all types of beetles. If you gather, if you together can catch twelve within five minutes, I'll give you some medals. Use that net you're holding to catch them. All right, let's get started. You ready? Get set. And now we're waiting for the others to go through the text. <laughs> that does happen when you're playing online multiplayer with some people. Go, alrighty, so this is this is fun. Um essentially you can earn medals on the island, and I don't think I explained this too well last time. They're essentially for uh oops, I scared one away, gosh darn it. Uh for purchasing special items that can only be purchased on the island. Uh including the diving suit, which I think is probably the most important item you can get here. And uh as you can see, we're all kind of just hunting for uh for beetles right now, if we get 12, we're gonna earn a bronze medal. If we get more than that, we could get, you know, silver or gold, um, which is gonna be a lot of fun. Whoops. And the reason why there's a... It's a good idea to have more friends coming with you is because the more friends you have, the more medals you have the chance to earn. So it is... It's definitely recommended to try and get together with people online or, you know, friends IRL and, uh, and hunt for beetles together. Ooh, this should be difficult. This is a golden stag, I believe. I'm a little bit rusty when it comes to bug hunting still, I feel like. Okay, I think we got it. We didn't get it, okay. I'm like weighing down my team right now, I feel bad. <laughs> Anyways, well, that's essentially the uh, the gist of it. That's why I wanted to have as many people as possible to show you guys. Um, there are uh, badges and stuff like that to be earned for earning a certain amount of medals, I believe. Doing tours, maybe? I'm not exactly too sure. I am, like, failing at bug catching. I think I'm going too close to the shadow of the tree, and that's that's what it is. I will try harder. <laughs> and maybe not talk as much while I'm trying to hunt bugs. Mm, I don't see anything. Nope. I hate coming down because I feel like I'm going to scare away all of them on these trees. 
vanilla is doing very good mayor vanilla to be specific. Um, I do enjoy doing this. Occasionally I would like to have viewers over to film episodes with me. It's, it's been quite fun. It's very easy to organize on the Discord also, which is oh, pretty good. Okay, let's see if we can catch this one. Hopefully. We're gonna try and line it up perfectly. We'll see. There we go. There's one. <laughs> Finally. Oh my goodness, I feel so silly. Oh, hi Forrest. <laughs> I, uh, I kind of feel bad. All these people have like all their emotes and everything unlocked. I don't have any, so I can't really communicate too easily with them on here. It's kind of embarrassing. Oh, there's one. I don't know if that's one I should be catching. It is a beetle, I guess, but... Oh, this is going to be difficult. It's hidden. Oh, hey, I caught it. Awesome! <laughs> and it caught- and it, uh, counted too. So we should at least get a bronze medal. I, I would like to get silver, or not silver, so my goodness, gold. Because uh, we get the most medals that way, but you never know. Yeah, I was going a bit too close to the Shadow of the Trees, and that's what I was doing when I was on the island as well, unfortunately. Okay, so we met our goal of... Let me scare that one away. Of 12, uh... 12 bugs, beetles to be specific. Um, but yeah, these tours are pretty fun to do with your friends. You can also go to Club Tortimer, which, if you aren't aware, there is essentially a version of the island where you can match up and play with random people online. And it's a little bit, uh, take your chances sort of thing, because some people on there can be real brats and really rude, but other times you'll have people who actually just want to play and make friends and stuff like that, so that's pretty cool. But, uh, you definitely should be careful about that. That, again, is something that you can purchase on the island. I think it's a, quite a good number of bell- or not bells, sorry, medals to purchase it, but it, it is purchased from the island shop. So if you ever see, like, what looks like a piece of paper, uh, take a look at it. It's probably called Tortimer Pass. So, uh, now you know. I don't know if I'll exactly be showing that off online. It isn't really something I care too much about online. On the, uh, on the Let's Play, that is, but... We'll see. I think we may need 24 for for gold, but I don't think I don't I don't know. I don't know you guys, we might not make it. If you're wondering why I'm walking slow, by the way, I find the beetles on the palm trees to be easily scared, just like obviously the ones on the island, so uh it's kind of just for safety's sake. <laughs> One more. I think we just need one more. Oh, we got it. Awesome. I think that was it. Hopefully. Alright. There we go. So, let's see how we did. And that was a hoot. Let's take a gander at the results. Uh, let's see here. Caught 24 bugs. That's enough to get your gold Tortimer award and six medals. Awesome. Alright, so I think that number doesn't change. It's your participation uh, bonus, as he's saying here, that changes. So I don't think I did very well in this one. Vanilla did very good, I know. Oh, hey, I did really decent. Usually, usually Arcadis is the one beating me, but that's pretty cool. But yeah, that's exactly why you should go with as many people as possible. It's just, it's more fun that way anyway. There's a lot more chaos and running around, especially if you're doing like the hide and seek tours or the hammer tour or something. It's a lot of fun. By the way, never ever ever challenge Argus to uh, a hide and seek tour. He will beat you so hard. He's really good at finding things. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> this is fun. Oh, I, I fell off. <laughs> My bad. See, they have emotes and I don't. I, I can't do anything other than wiggle in my chair. <laughs> oh, Elite Scavenger Tour. Alright, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> this is more of his thing. He's really good at it, so.
All right. Thanks for joining us on the Elite Scavenger Tour. Today you'll be hunting for scavengers, you know, vultures, hyenas, and the like. Or was it furniture? Ah, oh, right, furniture. You'll be hunting down chairs, tables, and other furnishings. I've given you a list of furniture that you need to find. Just check your pockets for the scavenger hunt list. And each of you sprouts has a list of different items, so keep that in mind. You have six minutes to find everything on your list and report back to me. Alright, there we go. So this one's pretty fun. If you guys have watched any of my streams, you might have seen... Oh, maybe a month or so ago, I got kind of trolled by a mod <laughs> while doing this tour. So first off, I want to check my list. Country guitar, red vase, and a frog woman pole. I know what the first two are, but what on earth is the last one? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go away from where everyone else is, because I believe this is one of the tours where you cannot have more than one person in a house at once, so I'm not gonna try and bother. <laughs> Red Vaz, uh, Frogman Pole, and a uh, Country Guitar. I don't think the Frogman Pole is in there. Unless it was that column thing. I'll keep it in mind. But uh, yeah, this tour really does test your knowledge of, uh, <laughs> of uh, exactly what items are. For the most part, I'm okay with it. It's usually when you give me like totem poles and stuff, I don't know. <laughs> Um, okay, I don't think any of this is it. I'm gonna guess that the, uh, the frogman pole is some sort of totem pole, but I'm not sure yet. <laughs> That looks like a bird. I'm gonna check it just in case. What is it? No. Display it. Don't want it. Um. Okay, so I don't think any of those are in here. Okay, two houses left down here. Whoops. <laughs> Hopefully they're actually in them and I didn't just skip over them like... You know, like a really smart person. <laughs> uh, I think this is the country guitar. Is this the frog? Bear pole. Alright, so I think I'm right about it being a totem pole, but I don't think I've seen it yet. And final house, please be in here, please. <laughs> Are you a frog? You don't look like a frog. Oh, frog woman pole, country guitar, red vase, check my list. I'm done, so I think I just have to go talk to Tortimer now and then I'm done. There we go. All right, he's right down here. Hello there, sir. Awesome, I'm done. Um, all right, so everyone else is still out there looking. I'm gonna message to see if anyone needs any help. Whoops. Oh, well, there's uh, Arcadis. And there's Forest, I think. Oh, <laughs> I think Arcadis is picking up flowers. A twin palm. Uh, I think it might have been one of these houses. Okay, I don't think it's any of those. I know I've seen a palm somewhere in here, so it's just a matter of remembering which house. Oh gosh, Arcadis is just... Elastic banding, it might be that one or it could be one of these. A fan palm. 
Okay, so someone is in there. Uh, let's check out this one. I'm guessing that was Forest who is in there, or if not Vanilla. These are definitely not palms. Actually, bleh. no, I think I know what the fan palm looks like. I'm gonna check that one just in case it is, but it might not be. I think, by the way, this tour is based off of how much time we have left, ter determines if we get gold, silver, bronze, etc. That's a corn plant. Alright, definitely not. <laughs> That's weird. Uh, is this it? Got it. Alright. I should go drop it by Captain. Hopefully she gets to it in time. Gosh, loading screens, hurry up. <laughs> okay. Oh, did she find it? Eh, I don't think I can message her in time and no. Gosh darn it. <laughs> I guess maybe she didn't see that far house, but that's okay. Oh, that tour is kind of frustrating if you, uh, Maybe you don't see a house on the map or something like that, but that's totally fine. <laughs> well, you can't win them all. Oh well, that's alright. We don't get any medals for that because we didn't uh, complete it in time. But that is totally fine. We can actually try again. We'll see what Arcanist decides to choose. Uh, if you're wondering why I'm letting him choose all the tours, it's because I haven't unlocked the later tours yet. I see I need a certain number of medals as I think I said last time. And uh yeah, we we haven't done that yet. So <laughs> I probably end up doing that on stream. Darn it, sorry. I need to type back to her. Yep. It's Okay. No worries at all. <laughs> Alright, so I think that was a tuna hunting or fishing, you know, what I'm talking about to her, so that's gonna be pretty fun. I still haven't found a tuna as, uh, as this character and I've been looking too. Okay, uh, tuna kahuna truer. So you'll be catching tuna, all tuna, all the time. It's so like I say, you can't tune a piano, but you can't. Okay, whatever, Totemer. <laughs> that was that was. I can't even comment on that. Sixteen in six minutes. All right, we'll try to do that. Man, everyone here has pretty hair too. I'm stuck with the hair plane because I'm so new to the game right now. Well, technically not new at all, but the save file is new. Alrighty. Let's see if we can find some tuna. Well, that looks like it could be one. Oh, if I want to be able to catch it. <laughs> oh, gosh darn it. <laughs> that noise spooked me. There's another one. I'm sure there'll be plenty along here, so I'm not that worried. There we go, there's one. I can tell just by the size. Woo! Awesome! Hi, forest. <laughs> Are you creeping? Oh, you're so cute. I wish I could, like, virtually hug you, but I can't. I'm sorry. Gosh darn it, Forrest, I see you trying to try to sneak up on my fish. <laughs> oh, there's one. 
Oh, you can have it, you can have it. Take it. <laughs> I'll go find another one. I, I think I enjoy the fishing ones most out of all these tours, although if you want to earn medals really quickly in bulk, try doing a dragonfly tour. I think it's like a middling one. This... is that a tuna? Uh, you earn a lot of bells, or oh my goodness, bells medals very quickly from doing it. Ah, that's probably a tuna. It looked kind of, yeah, it looked kind of short from that angle, but it's just with perspective. Oh, there's one, I think. Notice me, senpai fish, <laughs> please. we go. Awesome. Now if only I could find them this easily back in Rosewith, I would be set. <laughs> uh, okay. Nothing was more aggravating though than finding the ore fish, which is the last fish I needed in my other town, on tours like constantly. Oh, missed that one. I was talking. That's my bad. I really shouldn't talk while I fish. <laughs> or bug hunt, apparently. Hello there. So we should make it at least to a... I guess a silver or a bronze, maybe? We're doing very good, so I'm not that worried. I think it's Argetus right now, though, who's been trying to work towards his, uh... metal badge. <laughs> um, I... I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get all the badges in a year on this on this save file, but uh, I'm gonna try my best to get a lot of them for you guys, so, you guys, so that you guys can at least see them, or maybe maybe even just the beginner badges for a lot of them. That way I can. Uh, oh, that's definitely not a tuna. I'm gonna scare that away, just that a tuna might spawn. Uh, just so that you guys can see what it takes to get them, because if you get the beginner one, it kind of gives you some form of an idea. I'm just gonna skip ahead if you don't mind me, Mayor Vanilla. <laughs> I haven't seen a tuna in a very long time. I feel like someone's going ahead of me and like sniping them. <laughs> oh, hello there. Gosh darn it. <laughs> There's another one. Awesome. So clearly there are other fish that can spawn here, as was shown by that little one, but kind of few and far between, which is actually pretty darn good for us, so I'm not going to complain any. Uh, oh, nope, not a tuna. Go away. Oh, hello there. <laughs> I don't think I've seen Arcadus at all. I have a feeling he's the one who's ahead of me somewhere. There we go. I'm really honestly much better at catching fish if I don't look at the screen. It just distracts me. Oh, hello there. That was a nice spawn. Oh, if I would actually use it properly. Gosh darn it. <laughs> I missed that. I think that was a bite at least. Oh well. 21, we, we passed our goal. I think we'll at least get silver, maybe? I'm not sure.
21 fish, all right. Not some cat, you were to bronze Tortimer Warden, 10 medals. 10 medals for bronze? That's pretty darn good. Uh, you get an extra bonus? All right. Yep, as I said, Arcanist usually beats me, and then there's me. Forest, followed by Mayor Vanilla. Awesome. So that actually gave you quite a lot of medals. I didn't realize it would do that. So I think we have time for one more this episode and then we'll be heading home. Hi, Forest. <laughs> Are you flirting with the, the peoples? So cute. <laughs> Or are you teasing me to the fact that I don't have emotes and you do? <laughs> I cannot wait to unlock them on this character. Oh my goodness, that was some interesting uh, maneuvering, Arcanist. He just kind of went straight through the back of my chair. Oh, I guess we're going to do the scavenger tour once again. But I think this is the easy one. I don't know if we did the hard one or not last time. I didn't really take note. I think we might have. I think it said elite, I think. Alright, so I think on the easy one you have less items, I believe. Let me just skip through all this text since I've read it to you all before. Okay, um, let's check out our list. Modern sofa, deer scare. I don't know what that is, and a retro fridge. Was that. Did that say retro fridge or retro sofa? What's a deer scare? <laughs> okay, I think that's the retro fridge. I think. Yeah, alright, there's one thing. So, modern sofa and a deer scare, whatever that is. Like, what a weird item. But I guess they do usually give you, like, one kind of- oh gosh, that's interesting. <laughs> one kind of weird item. I think, uh, me and Ark are having some connection issues here. <laughs> Okay, none of that is anything I need. <laughs> Unless a deer scare is a plant. I honestly don't know what it is. <laughs> okay. Hi, Ark. Oh, gosh, okay, you know, no, you're in line. I'm, I'm just gonna go to a different house. Hi! She kind of matched the house, it's very pink. <laughs> uh, is this isn't a modern sofa, is it? Regal sofa, okay, never mind. I'm gonna start checking plants just in case, because I don't know what a deer scare is <laughs> at all. Um, let me go over here. Viola, or forest, needs a classic bed. Uh, I think I've seen that in the house I was just in. I'm gonna wait here. Does anyone know what a deer scare is? It's the nice thing about being able to ask uh, people who you're playing with via the text thing. Deer scare? <laughs> Question mark? Scare Northwest. Alright, um, maybe I missed it then. Unless this is the Northwest house. Okay, modern bed, just need the deer scare.
bamboo thingy. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what it looks like, so I wouldn't know. But uh, that is the fun thing about this tour. Now, guaranteed, I will probably always know what a deer- Oh, wait, I think I know what a deer scare is. I hadn't been in this house yet anyway, so of course. There it is, that thing. That's not the right thing. <laughs> I picked up something wrong. Uh, yes, display. Sorry about moving you. Alright, so let's go hand this stuff into Tortimer. I think I saw Arcadis had finished, or is it uh, Forest 2 finished? Okay. Need a modern bed. Wait, did I take the modern bed? I think mine was the modern sofa. I stole the modern bed. I'm gonna put that on the ground now. I'm going to give that to him. I trolled him without meaning to. Alright, I think the modern sofa was in that house though, I think. I thought it was bad, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Oh, hello. That was... That was kind of awkward. Modern sofa. I just- I went straight for the bed, I think. That was my bed. <laughs> okay, let's go hand this in. That, that was completely my fault. I shouldn't have done that. Me! I'm not done. I'm running into trees. There we go. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Sort of reward. We probably would have gotten much better if I hadn't done that. That's totally my fault. I feel bad. <laughs> but uh, this is how this type of thing goes. <laughs> Especially with the lack of like verbal communication between players, it's a little bit difficult to uh, coordinate stuff like that. And yes, the chat, the the text thing is pretty fun, but like it uh, it doesn't always work. Excuse me. Alrighty, let's head back. Uh, yeah, I'm going back. Sure, why not? Alrighty, let's head off then, shall we? That was pretty fun though. I hope you guys enjoyed that, uh, that episode. It was a little bit different. I did all my chores and stuff off camera, so I hope you guys are are okay with that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, next episode I think will be, uh, oh gosh, what did I have to do? I think we're gonna start working on our next public sports project, which I have to decide what that is. If you guys have any recommendations, please let me know. And if I don't get any recommendations that like stand out to me, I might actually just do the museum second floor, but we'll see how things go. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna leave you guys as captain's music for today, and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Uh...